Hello, welcome back to the Marching Art Show, the tech show about hacking. There is something called the Terminator malware, and it is supposedly made by Russians. I'm going to tell you why you, you at home, need to worry about this malware. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. We're going dark. Uh, this Terminator is being promoted by a threat actor named Spyboy on a Russian language hacking forum. Uh, it supposedly this thing has supposedly has the ability to disable various antivirus and extended detection and response security solutions. However, cybersecurity company CrowdStrike has contradicted these claims, stating that Terminator is merely a sophisticated form of a bring your own vulnerable driver attack. Let's dive into the details. According to reports, Terminator has the alleged capability to circumvent 24 different antivirus, EDR, and XDR security solutions, including Windows Defender. How many of us have Windows Defender? Spyboy, the threat actor behind Terminator, offers the software at varying prices depending on single bypass or comprehensive all-in-one bypass. In a disclaimer, Spyboy specific specifies that certain EDRs such as Sentinel-1, Sophos, CrowdStrike, Carbon Black, Cortex, and Silence cannot be sold individually. They also state that, they're, that they are not responsible for any actions rel related to ransomware or lockers. But is it what it appears to be? As disclosed by a CrowdStrike engineer in a Reddit post, Terminator simply drops a legitimate and signed Z-Mana anti-malware kernel driver named zamguard64.sys or zam64.sys into the C Windows System 32 directory with a randomly generated name between 4 and 10 characters. Once the malicious driver is written to the disk, Terminator loads it to leverage its kernel leverage um, privileges, enabling the termination of user mod processes associated with AV and EDR software running on the affected device. To utilize Terminator, clients must possess administrative privileges on the targeted Windows systems and deceive the user into accepting a user account controls UAC pop-up that appears when executing the tool. This technique is similar to other BYOVD campaigns observed. The bottom line, presently the vulnerable driver used by Terminator is only being identified by a solitary anti-malware scanning engine as indicated by a virus total scan. Fortunately, Florian Roth, the head of research at Nextron Systems, and Ness Redden, uh, a threat researcher, has have promptly shared Yara and Sigma rules that enable defenders to detect the vulnerable driver utilized by the Terminator tool. Uh, this proactive approach would assist defenders in identifying and mitigating the presence of vulnerable drivers in their systems. My goodness, you mean to tell me that there is something? that can bypass over 20 different antivirus and EDRs. <laughs> oh, man. These hackers are starting to get more and more better. What do you think about this? I want to know your, I want to know your opinion. Please hit the subscribe button. Please hit the notification bell. I love you. Stay safe. See you in the next video.